Yo, what up, though? Man, shout out to everybody watching my videos, man. And subscribe to the channel, man. I really appreciate that. So please subscribe to the channel. Do that right now for your boy. Especially if you like my content. Subscribe to the channel. But look, man, we got to talk about this. The Lamar Jackson and the Baltimore Ravens, man, they are tripping. Damn. Man, I ain't, I ain't never seen nothing like this before. I ain't going to hold you up. The Baltimore Ravens, man, playing hardball. And Lamar Jackson came out today saying on March 2nd, he asked the Raven to trade him, man. Lamar requested for a trade. Like, who ain't see that coming up? Like, people going to say, the Ravens, they offer him a contract. Man, you know the contract they offered Lamar Jackson, man? And it's crazy. I had to look it up for myself. The Raven offered Lamar Jackson a three-year deal, $133 million guaranteed. Like, what? So, basically, he began paid like 43 a year for three years. But peep this, though. Dax Prescott signed a four-year deal, $40 million a year, and his fully guaranteed is one sixty. So y'all want Lamar Jackson to get less fully guaranteed than Dak? Man, I know Baltimore tripping, man. Lamar Jackson won an MVP with the Ravens. Won the playoff game and everything within his rookie deal, man. His rookie contract. And y'all offer my mans a less guarantee than Dak Prescott? I want to sign that damn contract neither. Like, man, y'all are tripping. Dak ain't did nothing. Dak ain't nothing like no Lamar Jackson. And Dak got way more weapons than Lamar Jackson, man. Lamar Jackson ain't never had no weapons in Baltimore, man. Let's be for real. We got to talk about this. Everybody in the AFC, man, have weapons. The Chargers got weapons. The Bengals got weapons. The Chiefs have weapons. Who else over there? Uh, shit, Jacksonville got weapons. Man, shit, everybody, all the top teams in the AFC had weapons, man. And Baltimore had no weapons, man. Baltimore had failed to give Lamar Jackson a decent offense, man. It had been about, what, five years now? Then the shit that really got me twisted, they keep on saying Deshaun Watson messed up the quarterback market. That while Lamar Jackson is going through what he's going through. No, that ain't true. Because Lamar Jackson was drafted in 2018 with Josh Allen, Baker Mayfield, Josh Rosen, and Sam Darnold. And all of those quarterbacks were drafted before Lamar Jackson. And Lamar Jackson did more than all those quarterbacks, man. And Buffalo signed Josh Allen to a contract back in August 2021. And Deshaun Watson ain't signed his contract until last year. So why didn't the Baltimore Ravens give Lamar Jackson the contract back in 2021 when he was eligible for a new contract? So this is the fucking Ravens fault. This ain't nobody fault but the Ravens. You can try to offer my man a deal like that to get paid less than that. Come on, man. That's so disrespectful. Oh, that's disrespectful on, on so many levels, man. Now I'm going to tell you all a list of the higher paid quarterbacks in the NFL, man. Aaron Rodgers signed a three-year deal with Green Bay with $150 million guaranteed, and he get paid $50 million 
this year. Then Kyler Murray signed the contract with Arizona. He got $230 million. He getting paid 46.1 a year. I don't know what he guaranteed that for real, but shit. They're better than what they were trying to get Lamar Jackson, I'll tell you that. Then Deshaun Watson signed the deal last year for five years with $230 million guaranteed. And Josh Allen signed the contract for six years with 43 a year with $258 million. So the bottom line is, man, the Baltimore Ravens, man, lost their mind. Ain't no way. And Lamar Jackson probably don't want to be in Baltimore anyway. Why would you want to finish your contract in Baltimore and you see they can't get you no weapons? You've been here all them years and you can't get no weapons over there. I don't want to be over there neither. Trade me. I ain't got to play for y'all. Man, they doing Lamar scouting, dog. I ain't never seen that before. I ain't going to hold you up. Damn. But the crazy part is, y'all put that y'all put that tag on Lamar. Like somebody about to offer y'all a two first round draft pick and pay this man down there $200 million guaranteed. Like, damn, y'all being greedy as hell. Y'all want us to pay this man some money and get y'all two first round draft picks? I don't see it. That too much. Maybe one. And maybe a third round draft pick, but you ain't getting you ain't getting no two first round. And I gotta pay the man too. The Baltimore Ravens, man, is tripping, man. This is all Baltimore fought, man, at the end of the day, man. Because y'all should have paid Lamar Jackson back in 2018, man. And he could have signed a contract like Josh Allen signed. And we won't be going through all of this. But the Ravens want to be smart. They so damn smart. They outsmart themselves, man. The Ravens is wrong in two left shoes, man. For real. Lamar Jackson, man, is the MVP, man. And he an animal, too. Give Lamar Jackson some weapons, man. Josh Allen ain't start getting better in the NFL until he got Stephon Diggs, man. And Jalen Hurst ain't get better until he got him a top wide receiver. A.J. Brown, man. Every quarterback need a top wide receiver, man. They doing Lamar Bow, man. Lamar Jackson, come on to Minnesota, man. We got JJ and TJ for you, man. And we will give Baltimore a first-round pick next year, though, not this year. Next year, we'll give him a first-round pick, man. He'll go crazy here in Minnesota. The Baltimore Ravens lost their mind, man. Then you see the other wide receiver came out and dogged the Baltimore Ravens when the GM said that stuff about the wide receivers. Man, they, I don't know what happened to Baltimore. Baltimore, man, they got too cocky. That's what it, that's what it is. This ain't the 90s or the early 2000s, man. You're not going to win no Super Bowl with no Trent Dilfer in the top five defense. The NFL ain't set up like that no more, man. The NFL is all about offense, man, and that's a fact. Y'all seen that Super Bowl? Shit, both of them teams put up 65, 67 points to fire. And the, and the shit, Eagles, we thought their defense was the shit. But, man, that's just my thoughts on Lamar Jackson and the Baltimore Ravens drama, man.